guys, I always do a little fun loot crate thing, but this week I'm not going to be doing uh, the the loot crate announcement. This week, my new character oh, that I've been God. workshopping, oh, no. Brody Slater of Malibu, California, is going to be doing the loot crate ad. I've been workshopping this. <laughs> no. I've, been, I've been doing some acting coach work with how, it. How, no. how, how you never did a run on SNL is beyond me. This is just, it's a showcase for Loot Crate, but it's also a showcase for my oh, acting. Right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm just into the character. I'm not ready for this. <clears throat> Yes, surf bros and bunnies. Oh, no. oh dear. December can be a Mondo Bogus bummer. You want to lock in on a maxed out cruncher, ride an outside break, or shoot the curl on an epic set, but you can't. It's too cold. The beaches are blown out, the swells are glossy, and you feel like you're getting a sand facial, like some gremlin poser, am I right? Oh, well, not for long. Get out again with December's radical loot crate. The premier duds will get your heart beating like a gnarlacious double spinner, toes on the nose. The geeky gear will make you feel like you're dropping in on the wedge, pruning out at Pendleton, or taking a face goofy foot at Sano. Outrageous! <laughs> so don't wipe out. Sign up for Loot Crate at lootcrate.com slash Roll. Promo code CalcoRoll for Tars Hell of your first bar. <laughs> Bonsai! All right. Woo! That was it's pretty good. It's sort of got a little Scottish at the end. Yeah. So, so, uh, <laughs> somewhere in Topanga Canyon right now, Dweezil Zappa is bleeding from the nose, going, <laughs> Oh! Uh, what? What? That blue hair did something oh. for your complexion. Mm. Mm. Yeah, no, you were glowing. It's no moments no wonder you're in voiceover. I mean, we're versatile actors, and I just want to showcase that to the people. I hope well, that's, sure that's a sneak peek of your character in the next campaign, Sam. Definitely. Okay, I haven't done this in a while, so I'm falling back in on an old crutch, an old beloved character. Um, oh, no. Rody Slater is back to do another round. Oh, my God. Got a character. <laughs> Yo, ho, ho, it's me, Rody Slater, with another message from our sponsor, Lutcrat. <laughs> Whether you're dropping in on a party wave in Uluwatu or even Tamarindo, you won't look like a paddle puss if you haul your tray gnarly gear from El Crato del Luto. <laughs> This month's theme is Build, featuring sick brands like Power Rangers, Hang Ten, Batman, Wax It Up, Lego, Mondo Bitchin, and Tetris, Shaka. <laughs> so don't get raked over by a wiper. Point your nose to lootcrate.com slash critical role and use promo code critical role for 10% off your subscription. You'll be radder than Tom Curran nailing a 360 air reverse rodeo. You'll be cooler than a tight onshore breeze at Malibu. You'll be more authentic than a sad voice actor searching for surfing terms on Yahoo Answers at 5 p.m. when he should be really spending more quality time with his children as their youthful lives pass by without their father. Precious moments ticking away until one day they're adults and you're standing at their wedding thinking, oh my god, I missed so much. I missed so very much. And for what? A loot crate ad? <laughs> anyway, ride that tube and subscribe to Dave Bonsai! <laughs> I mean, I mean, it's a whole new echelon. Oh my god. It's a whole new echelon. Uh, he just inceptioned the loot crate ad. I can't. Oh. Thank you uh, for that. Incredible. You took Sam. a failed Californian sketch yeah. and turned it into Oscar winning material. <laughs> Thank you very much. Oh, it hurts, it hurts. Uh, <laughs> I didn't know Brody, Brody's a father. That's a, interesting to look at. I'm here to talk to you about D&D Beyond as a, a returning friend of the show. Bonsai! Wave hogs and hoggets, it's Rody Slater, king of the kickflip, jamming about the frubs at D&D Beyond. Y'all know I love letting my leash out on maxed shore breaks at Steamer Lane. Rail bang! But when I'm not flashing the shaka at some Quimby on a softboard, I'm chillaxing with my buds with some gnarly role-playing games. Now, I'm partial to Dead Earth. Empire of Satanus and Fatal, <laughs> slotted, but my brohemes are hooked oh on 5th edition, <laughs> which means I get stoked for D&D Beyond. If there's one thing Rody Slater loves more than shacked Eskimo rolls, it's diligent organization. 
And right now, you can go to D&D Beyond's Facebook page and leave a comment on their top tw- top pinned post telling them your favorite moment from episode 11 of Critical Role to be entered to win a legendary bundle for out! <laughs> so don't be a Benny poser. Head on over to D&D Beyond and enter now. Hang 11! <laughs> Leave it on because you kind of look like a Stelgetian. Oh, yeah, <laughs> 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 Hang on. <laughs> if Jakasta comes back later on, you can play his spiritual weapon. That made Be perfect. Me uncomfortable so oh. fast. <laughs> oh. oh. The character didn't click until he said he played Fatal, and I was like, oh, I know who this is now. <laughs> I don't even know what that is. I looked at it. Don't. It's awful. It's the third time we've had him in, yes, in, in our uh, lifetime. Fan favorite, man. <laughs> and by fan, I mean me. <laughs> <laughs> D and D Beyond, a consistent and amazing sponsor of our show, wants to wants to let you guys know that Mordenkainen's Tomb of Foes is out. It's out. Get get yours right now on the D and D Beyond website. And to celebrate, I called my old friend Rody Slater. Oh, oh. <laughs> ready? Hang ten kahunas in wahines, it's Rody Slater. Duck diving the word from D&D Beyond. Yank that leash and wrap up the Dawn Patrol, because if a player in your campaign has a master level subscription, any player that owns Mordenkainen's Tomb of Foes can share content with everyone in your party. Frothy, right? Well, kick out your longboard, because... Because... <laughs> You know what, guys? I'm sorry. I can't. Oh, no. I can't. I can't do this. It's not. It's not D and D Beyond. They're a great sponsor. It's. It's me. You know, like. I just felt like, at this point in my career, I'd be doing serious <laughs> shit, like Ibsen or O'Neill. Yeah, it's a scaling twist. But I'm like, I'm doing this shitty Keanu Reeves voice <laughs> and writing crappy sitcom catchphrases. No offense, Ashley and. <laughs> Like, okay. you know, this stuff's gonna live on the internet forever. Yeah. And yeah. my kids are gonna watch this and be like, wow, your dad was a loser, you know? It's, yeah, that's what I, we think. I just time. feel like yeah. there's, I can do so much more. Oh, sorry, getting a phone call. This is embarrassing. Hello? Yeah? Uh huh. Really? Yes, yes, I, I accept. Okay, thank you. <laughs> that was my agent. Guys, I booked a two-spot local radio campaign <laughs> for for Lord of the Wings, that new wing place oh, in Chatsworth. Please, two that. radio spots. Oh. I'm a real actor again. I'm back. All right, where was I? So wax down your, that twin fin and pull a thruster on an epic left, because D&D Beyond is righteous. Bonsai! Oh, wow. oh my God. What a crazy oh. turn of events. That's, that's why I'm so happy. I'm so proud. Of you. Really you did it, Sam. Congrats, man. It. Congrats, buddy. Wow. <laughs> Hashtag booked it. That was so authentic to the actor experience. Oh. Man. Yeah. And really believable. Wow. Yeah. And Lord of the yeah. Wings is not a bad restaurant. No, Lord of the Wings is really average. And it's a, <laughs> it's a regional spot. Yeah, yeah. 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 I might get some. I might get some residuals. Yeah. 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 <laughs> on, a, on a side note, Matt, you looked so quietly pained to hear Mordenkine and bathed in whatever that was. I, I, I wasn't pained. I was more contemplating the fact that those two facets have never combined until this point, probably. Uh-huh. Yeah, probably haven't heard anyone talk about you know Odalux Resilient Spare. You know, I, so you know. I, I kind of, uh, I kind of like the prospect of like a, like a super big sur- surf tour of D and D wizard names. <laughs> Uh, Lord of the Wings, oh. I, I would go there. Oh, yeah. Just, 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 yeah. No. Lord of the Wings. Oh, man. More, more Cayenne oh, Wings. Oh, yeah. oh. Oh. There you go. Until then, we have some few announcements to get to, oh, uh, beginning with our fantastic sponsors at D&D Beyond, uh, and welcome our friend, Polly. No. Polly? No. Hey! Hey, guys! Oh boy, this is gonna be hard. <laughs> nope. <laughs> hey, yo, I'm Paulie, I'm a shark. Full name's Paul Vincent D'Onofrio, oh. no relation. Uh-huh. 
I'm an East Coast shark originally, but D&D Beyond asked me to come over here and swim by and tell yous about their app and also to tell yous that they're heading to the Mile High City for the Denver Pop Culture Con. Autographs and photo op tickets are now available at denverpopculturecon.com. We're looking forward to meeting you. Why did they choose me to make this announcement? Hey, I got no friggin' idea. I'm a friggin' shark. The only D and D I know are Dungeness crabs and dragonfish. Hey, hey. Uh, no. <laughs> until recently, I thought an app was eating the boogie board before I eat the guy riding it. But um, hey, but seriously, folks. <laughs> I shouldn't be here. I spend most of my time swimming, eating surfers, swimming, shutting down half my brain so I can go to sleep while I'm swimming. But when D&D Beyond called me, I thought, hey, why not, right? I got some time. Shark Week's not until July, so uh, I'll, I'll dig into it. And holy carp, let me tell you, this app is friggin' money. They got these cool weapons and classes, right? Blood mage, blood cleric, blood hunter. I'm a blood hunter. I can relate to that one. They got a thing in there. It's a, it's a homebrew, but it's called a shark folk. I started really getting into it, right? I, I went on the app. I bought some of their books. Out of the Abyss, Sword Coast, they even got one called Water Deep. Hey, my backyard's Water Deep. Hey, yo. No, <laughs> no, no, no. I mean, come on. <laughs> Lo and behold, <laughs> one thing leads to another. Bada bing, bada boom. Now I got a friggin' campaign going. Me and some pals, we toss out some chum. We play in an old shipwreck down there. It's real wholesome. <laughs> my. <laughs> My current character is a sea elf ranger named Ursula Le Fin. <laughs> I had some fan art for her done, but it got too wet. Um, <laughs> I play with a great yeah. bunch of guys and girls. Jill the Hammerhead is our healer. Left Shark is our bard. Uh, this octopus wow. named Frumpkin sometimes drops in. My neighbor Nikki is our Dungeness Master. He's a crab. And we used to play with this surfer named Rhodey Slater, but I got hun hungry and I ate him. Anyway, so what I'm saying to you guys is, almost done. <laughs> what I'm saying to you guys is, we got room at the table. So if anyone out there is looking to join a cool campaign, shoot me an email. Let me give you my email address. Ready? That's dolphins. That's that. <laughs> at earthlink.net. Oh, <laughs> anyway. Earthlink. <laughs> If an apex predator like me can get into D and D Beyond, wow. shouldn't you? Sign up today, or I'll hunt you down and kill you while you swim. All right, bye. Peace, everyone. <laughs> Oh, no. No. Uh, is that a Th tail th and a fin? No. Thank you, Polly. <laughs> Where are you? <laughs> We're gonna smoke this thing. <laughs> Can I do it over here? Not in the studio. You gotta go out to the sidewalk. So, uh, as we know, when <laughs> when political votes start getting really close, people start pulling out all the stops and doing ridiculous things to get your attention. So, uh, thank you. Is there a term called jumping the shark? Oh, well, long, long, long ago did that occur, Laura. Wow. Well, thank you, oh. Sam and Polly. Uh, a drink. Thank you very much, our friends at D&D Beyond, for enduring the, the, the onslaught weekly that we all do. Oh, hey, Sam. Oh, hi, guys. Oh, hey. Hey. I'm sorry I'm late. Did I miss anything? Did I miss some high quality comedy? Yeah, there was a short name, uh, Polly, that came oh, through. Oh, Polly? Yeah. Polly Vincent's enough for you? Might have been you know, the one. You know, you know them. Oh. <laughs> 